Hey English learners, welcome back to another edition of today's idiom. Okay, so today's idiom is a lot at stake. A lot at stake. Okay, so when you first hear a lot at stake, you think of steak. Not steak like the meat, but steak, S-T-A-K-E. Steak has different meanings. One of the meanings is a wooden or metal post with a sharp point at the end okay we're not talking about that okay that's just the point that you use for vampires or to stake to put on the side of a tent that keeps the tent from moving we're talking about stake like a lot at risk okay so um a lot at stake means being at risk that you might lose damage or be not successful at something um, the tension is really, really high, success and failure. When you have something a lot at stake is uh, when you might lose something. So, example, let's say people say uh, it's game seven of a series or game four of a baseball series. If the Yankees lose, they have a lot at stake at the game because if they lose, they can advance, right? Or in the stock market, you say, I have uh, a lot at stake on this, whatever the case may be. So you would use it in a sense to say is, if I don't do this, something bad might happen. So if I, I have a lot at stake in this school, if it fails, I lose all my money, right? Or um, when you're playing a game, you have to win this match. You have a lot at stake in this match, if not, you can advance. So remember, when you use a lot at stake is when if you don't succeed at something, you can't advance or you can't move forward. So something might break, might damage, or you might lose it. I hope that helps you. Uh, write your sentences at the bottom of the comment section, and I hope to hear from you guys soon. Take it easy, and I'll see you next time, guys. Peace. Where We are determined to get to the bottom of the problem. So... Let's say that you're in a corporate uh, company or you're in a company and you want to say something happened and you want to say that you are going to investigate it. You say, I'm going to get to the bottom of this. Or a lot of movies have it when detectives are looking for a criminal or the reason why something happened, they say, I'll get to the bottom of this. Uh, so you can use it in that sense. There's many different ways that you can use it too. Um, so just think of it, it means is to get uh, to the beginning or the reason of something. Okay? I hope that helps you guys. Take it easy and I'll see you around. I'll see you guys.